Welcome to the Fields of Code tutorial series and to this tutorial creating a report to display a patient's medical history. Let's take a look at how you can output the information from the patient documents HX page to a report. Select the report's gateway. Press the New tab. Select Patient Document from the Report Type drop-down list. I will call my report HX and press the Add button. There are several built-in data markers to help you generate the report. Press the Add One or More Data Markers to the Canvas button on the toolbar. Begin by selecting Today's Date. Open the Patient's Folder. Expand the HX section and I will choose all the data markers there which are equivalent to what appears on the patient's medical history page. I will take a moment to organize these on the campus. I would also like to have the name of the patient at the top of the report. So I'll drill down to the names region and I'll check the data marker that has the first and last name and the title as well. I'm using the mouse to drag it into a better position. For the information to make sense, I have to add labels on the left so that I can recognize what data each field represents. For this, I'm using the Add User Text to the Canvas and I will press it several times to add one for every data marker I already placed on the canvas. I will take a moment again to move the boxes around aligned to the left of the data fields. Now I will change the text in each box to specify the correct label like so. The name of the patient is slightly lost among all the data here so I'd like to emphasize it by using a different font. The data marker has to be selected. Click over it with your mouse. Then from the Properties pane on the right, I'll click inside the Value column in the font row, and the Navigation button appears. Pressing it loads the Font dialog box, where I can select a taller and bold font. This report is ready, but I have to save it before I can attach the report to the patient's document. Double-click the name of the patient in the Windows menu and select the Reports page. Press the List Add and Remove Attached Reports button and on that dialog box press the Add button. The list you see is all reports that can be attached to any patient document in the current database. I'll filter to find my report quickly by typing HX in the box at the top and click the report name with my mouse. I'll press OK and then click on Close in the dialog box that follows. Let's return to the HX page and make some changes. I'll add a new allergy, remove some of the existing flags, and add more medications. For this information to be picked up by the already attached report, I will have to first save the page. When I return to the report, the saved information becomes visible only after pressing the Refresh button. Indeed, I can see that the contents of the report have been changed. You can now print the report for internal use or as part of a referral letter to another physician. This concludes the Creating a Report to Display a Patient's Medical History tutorial. I hope you found this information valuable. Thank you for watching.